Wow, road cleaning in a ghost town. This is the first house you come to when we uh, are at Robsard. Robsard, small ghost town. I think there's one house here that uh, someone lives in. It's a big house, like three story, like a basement, uh, main floor, and then a second floor, like three floors. Big houses. Robsard. I didn't want to go inside because it, you know, might be the floors might fall in or something or pretty large places. And this is another house in Robsard. I was amused by the sign. No trespassing. Another big place. This is another little house that some people were picking rhubarb. I don't know if it was their house or what, but... And now let's take it drive down Main Street here. Look at that, an old car is still in the garage. <laughs> People walking around there doing work. Here's the Beaver Lumber Store. That's the end of that part. I'm going to turn around and we'll take a look at the other side. There's all the post office boxes for all the farmers and what have you. Every single one's abandoned. And I only did see one house uh, right here on the corner. One house that looks like someone's actually living in it. It looks new and clean and well kept. So we will have a look. We'll go up in here and have a look here. I think maybe this one here. I'm not too sure. We'll go have a look. Foundation is not too good here. An old sewing machine. All right, looks like they just picked up and left. Grabbed their clothes on their back and maybe a little bit more clothing. I didn't bother going upstairs, but uh, th there's a piano. I didn't see any uh, like rats or mice or anything in there, but they probably do go in there. I didn't see any nests or anything. Let's take a photo. I don't know what they took with them. <laughs> they left everything here. A piano. Nineteen seventy two. Holy smokes. Thanks for watching, guys.